Hi, it's Linda with No Frills ASMR. I thought we could continue looking at some of these vintage Pokemon cards. We have previously looked at this folder, which was all the, um, <clears throat> see these fall right out of here. I think I'm missing one. <laughs> but these are all the newer Pokemon cards. So if you're interested in that, there's a video with those. But last Sunday we looked at these vintage ones. I guess it's Pokemon Sunday because here we go again. <laughs> so I thought we could go through. Now we left off on a seal creature. <clears throat> yeah, so if you're interested in these, there's a video looking at all of these. There's, he's so cute. There's Pikachu. We left off on this guy. Yeah, all right, so let me turn off this light. <coughs> Oops. <laughs> I'm dropping stuff, guys. And then we'll bring the screen in just a little bit here. Probably about maybe right there. And you can see three. I want you to be able to see them, but not have it too, too, too. at how adorable this guy is. <laughs> I feel like I'm just slightly too tight. That's what she said. <laughs> okay, this is Seal. Look how they've spelled it. S-E-E-L instead of S-E-A-L. And his special thing is Headbutt. Yeah, he has three of these cards. These are my, by the way, if you haven't watched, these are my son's cards from probably when he was a kid. And he stuck them in these folders, so I just thought, I have no idea what's in here. I just thought we could go through them, take a look. Um, I don't think any of them are in, you know, they're not graded or <laughs> they're just cards. So. Anyway, okay, so here's Seal. Oh, in the last video, somebody, I think, told me what these symbols mean. I forgot to um, study that. <coughs> oh, well. All right, I have a magnifying glass because my vision isn't as good as, um, but I still can't see this one, it's too dark. Uh, I can't see, it looks like it says Ken, Ken somebody. All right, <coughs> star you, 40 HP, slap, <laughs> this is special power. And it says Ken. This is the same artist. Ken. Kimab I can't quite read it. Kimabuchi, maybe? Look at this one. Far fetched. Looks like he's having a little gas here. <laughs> Leak slap. Flip a coin. If tails, this attack does nothing. Either way, you can't use the attack again as long as Far fetched stays in play. Pot to smash. What is this supposed to look like? He's a basic Pokemon, 50 HP. And this is the same artist. All of, all of these, it looks like, is the Ken. I think that's kind of cool. I like this one. So he's called Farfetch'd. <laughs> this one's called Lickitung. And what is falling on him? Hold on. like they're leaves or something by Michuri Ar oh, Arika he did some of the other earlier ones we looked at 1999 to 2000 wizards if that means anything I don't know so he has 90 HP and he has one two of these tongue wrap <laughs> Supersonic flip a coin of heads. The defending Pokemon is now confused. 
So he's basic. And then there's Dratini. He's a dragon Pokemon. 40 HP. He's also by Ken, who did these other ones up here. 1999 to 2000 Wizards. Okay, well then I gotta get some more water, you guys, but I'll go ahead and get you guys up here. Oh, he has three of whatever. Do, do, duo? Do, oh, do, duo, so it's like a dodo. Like a dodo bird, but he's a dodo. Furry attack. Flip two coins. This attack does 10 damage times the number of heads. <laughs> a bird that makes up for... Wait, did I forget to read these? Oh, I want to go back and read. I like these things. <clears throat> I've forgotten from one week to the next what. <laughs> a bird that makes up for its poor flying with its first... With its... Man, my vision. With its fast Foot speed leaves giant footprints. <laughs> Wait, what was this guy's? Hold on. The protruding horn on its head is very hard. Boy, is this one hard to read. It's like so dark. You know what? You know what bugs me? When, and I'm not saying about this because this was a long time ago, but when graphic designers put dark print on dark color, The horse is used for bashing through thick ice. I guess that says the horn, <laughs> not the horse. What does this one say? Hold on. An enigmatic Pokemon that can Pokemon, sorry, that can effortlessly regenerate only any appendage it loses in battle. This one says, the sprig of green onions it holds in its weapon. This sprig used much like a metal sword. Oh, <laughs> he's not having gas. <laughs> it's a sprig of green onion. I, just th I thought this was coming out of his tail. <laughs> Whew, okay, sorry about that, guys. I have I'm not, it's not that I'm not taking it seriously. I just didn't understand. This one, its tongue can be extended like a chameleon's. It leaves a stinging sensation when it licks enemies. <clears throat> no comment. Okay. Dratini says, Long considered a mythical Pokemon until recently when a small colony was found living underwater. Oh, that's cute. Okay, let's move, move back over here. Sorry I'm moving this around so much. Oh, Meowth. I'm a cat girl. I love my kitties. It's funny because my cat just meowed. It would have been really cool if I can't tell if you guys could have heard that right when I put on Meowth. <laughs> Adores circular objects. <laughs> Wanders the streets on a nightly basis to look for dropped loose change. <laughs> I've never read that before, but he is sitting on a pile of change. Payday is his... That's cute. So my son has one, two, three, <laughs> four. I probably never let them trade these because I like I was probably like keep meowing. <laughs> okay. So another meowth, and then we have Ratata, Ratata, Ratata. <laughs> he must be Ratata. Maybe. Okay. Basic Pokemon. <clears throat> A bite is his thing. <laughs> voice just left me. Hold on. <clears throat> Bites anything when it attacks. Small and very quick. It is a common sight in many places. <laughs> like a rat. <laughs> and then this one. So this is basic. <clears throat> and this is evolved from Rattata to Rattus. Oh boy. Raticate. Raticate. Oh, like eradicate. Rattata and Raticate. <clears throat> Super Fang does damage to the defending Pokemon equal to half the defending Pokemon's remaining HP. Guys, I think I gotta get a haul. Sorry, hold on a sec. I'll try to be quiet about it. Sorry. I'll get it away from the microphone.
one second. Alright, did we read this one? <clears throat> it uses its whiskers to maintain its balance. It seems to slow down if they are cut off. Oh, well, that's kind of cute. I think it's so fun that these guys like, what a fun job to be in charge of designing these and then coming up with like their little story, backstory, and what their skill is. And you'd have to think about like who will now if, well, he's not a great example because I think he didn't evolve. But, like, who, what will he evolve into? And then what will be that character's special skills that align with this? I think that would be such a fun job. Like, talk about a fun, creative, <laughs> you know, thing to do. All right. Next page. Sorry. I whacked the ghastly. Ooh, spooky. Ghastly is a uh, 30 HP, so he's not very strong, right? <clears throat> Basic Pokemon. What does this thing say? Almost invisible, this gaseous Pokemon cloaks the target and puts it to sleep without notice. Um. And then this one, Spiro. Peck is his special thing. Eats bugs in grassy areas. It has to flap its short wings at high speed to stay airborne. And this is by Mitsu Hiro Arita. And this one, good grief, man, that is, I think when they, I don't know, it looks smaller. Am I holding this backwards? <laughs> Does it matter which way you hold a magnifying glass? Anyway, this is catchy. I can't, I really can't read it. It's so dark. Kim, Kimbuchi. <laughs> I don't know. I can't quite read it. Anyway. All right. So he's a basic. So we're looking for the evolution of these guys, right? But this artist, he isn't he the one who did like the, like the beginning Pokemon, I think. Well, what were the dates on these? Let's see. These ones were... 1999 to 2000. So these are pretty early, I guess. When did they start making these things? In the early 90s? Volpex. Basic. At the time of birth, it has just one tail. Its tail splits from the tip as it grows older. Oh, that's cute. I mean, who thinks of this? It's so smart. Ken. Sugomari. He is the one who did some of the ones we looked at at the beginning. Growlithe. Oh yeah, I remember Growlithe. Oh, how cute. So is he the evolution of it? No, he's not. Basic Pokemon. Uh, very protective of its territory. It will bark and bite to repel intruders from its space. Also by Ken Sugomori. 1999 to 2000. Okay, that, does that help you guys see that? Maybe a little bit. Oh, here we go. Somebody, somebody said something about a Machamp, I think. No, they said Machamp, not this guy. Anyway, <clears throat> Machop, ma <laughs> I don't know how to say that. Machop, 50 HP loves to build its muscles. It trains in all styles of martial arts to become even stronger. Game Freak 99-2000 and this is um, Mitsuhira I, 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 I should memorize this guy's name. Arita. So, he's, so he has one, two, three of those. Alright, what do we have here? Machoke. Oh my goodness, he has three of these. 80 HP. He evolves from Ma Chop. His special thing is Karate Chop and Submission. Its muscular body is so powerful that it must wear a P 
power save belt to help regulate his motions. We saw this one in one of the last videos because I remember reading that. I thought that he's too powerful so he has to wear this belt to like take away some of it. I do remember that. I feel like we saw this one too, didn't we? Diglett. One, two, three. Uh oh, wait. <laughs> Four, five. That must be an awfully common car. Mud slap. Lives about three feet underground where it feeds on plant roots. It sometimes appears above ground. And that's by Keji Kombuchi. Yeah, we saw him before. 1999 to 2000. And then, so we have five of those. And then down here we have a rye horn. I would check to see if there are more behind here, but I know people said I shouldn't, you know, mess with the things, but there might be. <laughs> I think this one might have more than one. Rye horn. <clears throat> um, horn attack. Basic Pokemon. Its massive bones are 1,000 times harder than human bones. It can easily knock a trailer, a trailer, a trailer flying. 1999 to 2000. So this is newer. Oh no. Wait. Didn't we have... Oh, I can't remember. Oh well, whatever. <laughs> and that's the Arita. Hold on a minute. Am I crazy? Were there some of these that were older? No, I guess not. Okay. This must be another common because he has four. It looks like one, two, three, four. But I think there might be two. <laughs> Tangela. Tangela? I like Tangela. I think it's a girl like Angela. Tangela. Its whole body is swathed, swathed in wide vines that are similar to seaweed. These vines shake as it walks. And this is Arita, the illustrator, from 1999-2000. And that's a basic. So we have to look for his, I want to call it evolution. Am I using the right word? Evolves. Yeah, evolution. That sounds right. Execute. Yeah, we saw this one before. Leech seed. Often mistaken for eggs. When disturbed, they quickly gather and attack in swarms. Oh, yeah. And then there's just like the backings, I think. Okay, hold on. To be able to see these a little better. Now I could take these out because they are in these hard, but I think we can see them through here as long as we don't have a glare. Let me just set them so they're kind of together. All right, so here we have a card called, is it <laughs> Dark Vaporeon, 60 HP. So this is a dark, so does that mean it's a bad guy? I think so. I think the dark cards are bad guys. I mean, it's not the Pokemon's fault. It's the trainers, right? <laughs> I don't know. What is this a picture of? That's like before it's, that's whatever it was before it's about. What is it? I can't read this one. Evolved from, oh, this is Eevee. Well, I love Eevee. Well, maybe it's not a bad guy then, because I thought Eevee was like a good one. I don't know, but this is cute. <laughs> it looks like a little, I don't know, it's got legs and a flipper tail. And then this little ruffle collar. <clears throat> what do they say? A Pokemon capable of controlling water. So it's capable of creating giant whirlpools. That's cool. But it's only a 60 HP. <clears throat> Does it have like any sparkly holographic? Nope. Okay. I think that's on the thing that's holding it maybe. All right, now we have dark. Oh, this is the one somebody mentioned in a comment that they have one of these, I think. 
dark mug jump 70 hp what does that say there evolves from dark ma joke hold on a minute guys i'm sorry i have to just look at something where is that ma oh so so in their other forms they can be basic dark or light is that and so he evolves from a dark What does it say? Does it say Machoke? No, Machoke. And what was this guy? I'm sorry. Machop. Okay, so he's just totally different. Never mind. Never mind. Never mind. So this is his special skill is Mega Punch. It's almost impossible to defend against a Machomp's four powerful arms. Oh, wait. Is his the one who wears the belt? Machoke. Okay, so Machop turns into Machoke, turns into him. But are there light and dark? Like, is he, could he have a Machomp light? <laughs> I don't know the answer to that. I'm asking rhetorical. That's not the right word. I'm just asking you guys. Anyway, all right, so... Oh, they don't tell you that. So they're there. I don't know why these ones are in a special, you know, extra thing, but I will show you. See, this one sparkles. Can you see that? Look how cool. It's got like stars upon the earth. But this one, no stars. <laughs> okay. Oh, I love this one down here. Are you guys ready for this? Do, 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 do. Basic Pokemon, 40 HP. This looks like a, not much of a card. He looks kind of old fashioned to me. <laughs> what does it say? Many people find it cute and try to hold it only to be burned by its tail. Yeah, I would think it's cute. It says by Kagamari Hamino. And then it's something 1999 2000 wizards, I think. Um, yeah, I don't know why this one's in a special. He maybe he just liked it because it doesn't look like uh, it has any special, or maybe it's just rare. I don't know. Okay, and then we have this one. I can tell you the condition doesn't look very good on that. All right. Dark Charmeleon, fifth Carmeleon, Charmeleon, fifty HP by Kigamori Hemino, maybe I can't quite see it. From Wizards, nineteen ninety thousand. Its tail is incredibly strong, able to lift up to five adult men. Whoa! So this evolves from Charmander. Char oh no he doesn't he's basic so this is his evolution but again this one's dark so are these guys eyes dark or can they go either way unknown all right so i don't know if you guys does that help i don't know i'm gonna return this see how they slide out of here that's why i kind of want to put it There's the back of them, but they're mostly in these dark. I mean, this one you see the back. I can see some, you know, wear on the edge. It looks okay. Oh, yeah, right there. See the white right there? That's on uh, Mart Machomp. Okay. He said, he said, uh, he didn't think any of them were. He hadn't looked them a long time, but he didn't remember that any of them were in. All right, Dark Rapatish, Rapatish, 60 HP. His special thing is Rear Kick. A wild, uncontrollable Pokemon. When running, it looks like a comet streaking through the sky. Ooh, how pretty. 
and he evolves from Bonita. Bonita. <laughs> Sounds Spanish Bonita. Uh, Kegamori Namina, maybe? I can't quite. 1999-2000 Wizards. This is called Slowpoke. I remember Slowpoke. Basic Pokemon <laughs> afternoon nap. Although it knows how to fish, no other intelligent behavior has been detected in it. <laughs> That's not noise. Um, Sumayashiri Kazuki. Boy, can I not read that? That's wizards too. A slow pokey naps. That's funny. I'm not a napper. Do you guys nap? <laughs> I just, I can't nap. And if I do, then I wake up feeling like drowsy. <laughs> I feel like this. All right, so he's basic. And then he's, oh, I thought maybe he turned into him, but no, he doesn't. He is a hypnosis poke Pokemon. A nightmare. His weakness is the eyeball thing. Which somebody told me, I'm telling you guys. Do you think I can remember anything? Somebody said the eyeball, what it means, I think. Anyway, whatever. <laughs> no, this one's hilarious. Oh my gosh. Wait till you hear this. Okay. Not popular with girls <laughs> because of its attitude can often be heard muttering to itself in a low voice. <laughs> that's hilarious. And that's its, <laughs> that's its thing. Huh? That's so funny. Uh, Okay, he's my new favorite. Not popular with girls because of its attitude. Can often be heard muttering in a low voice. <laughs> hmm. Funny. Squirtle. Shell attack. I think we saw one of these already. Cute Pokemon that charms people with its innocent eyes. Leaves, loves swimming all day long. Aw, Cheshaw Dracula, a pile squirrel. Weakness is like, what, electricity, maybe lightning, something. Illustrated by Nishida. Nishida. Uh, 1999-2000 Wizards. So these are all from, I guess, Wizards pack. Huh? This is Dark Primeape. Evolves from, what does that say, Monkey? Mankey. Put dark primate on the basic Pokemon. <laughs> he looks, he's got like a big nose. And then there used to be a character called, oh my gosh, what was he called? Oh well. Maybe it'll come to me, but it was like a fluff ball with eyes. <sighs> Back in the 70s. Anyway, if anybody remembers or has an idea of what I might be talking about makes me think of him. Um, although primates have always been mean, lately they seem to be, be seem to be becoming even more vicious and frenzied. Oh my gosh. Da, da, da. Okay, he is dark primate. He evolves from, so we haven't seen Mankey, have we? Oh yes, we have. Oh yes, we Here's Mankey. Normally friendly, it quickly becomes angry if it doesn't get what it, get what it wants. That's funny. It's like a two-year-old. <laughs> mischief. Yeah, this is a they base this on a two-year-old. He's mischief, anger. He gets mad when he doesn't get what he wants. <laughs> That's funny. Oh boy, I can't. It's too small. Simi. Maybe Simioshi. Kazuki, maybe? I'm having trouble reading that one. 1999 Wizards. That's like a real mm, basic kind of drawing, isn't it? And then over here we have Diglett. We've seen this one, right? Oh, my stomach's starting to crawl. Guys, I'm going to have to go eat soon. <laughs> I have to cook because I have family coming over. Basic Pokemon. I have to clean too. I don't want to do that, but <laughs> it follows onyxes in their tunnels looking for scraps of food they have left behind. <laughs> he 
he's a male Pokemon. I wonder why there are some that say like male or female. Apparently last time they had the symbols for male and female. And I <laughs> got them backwards. <laughs> uh, that sounds about right. <laughs> okay, we'll do this page and then um, I think I should start getting ready for the day. Dark do dark Doug Trio he evolves from Diglett. Look, there are three of them, and they've dug through this person's like room in their house. There's their bed and their desk. <laughs> Pokemon power sinkhole. <laughs> oh my gosh! Digs large sinkholes in the ground and tries to trap its enemies in them. Did you guys ever see in Pittsburgh there was a sinkhole that a bus went into one time, like a couple years ago? And it's just, you see the bus just like <laughs> on its side. Uh, sinkholes are dangerous. Anyway, um, what does that say? Kugamori Himinu from Wizards. And this one, oh, okay. Here's Machop. Now he turns into the one we were looking at. It's said that not even pro wrestlers can take down a Machop. Ken Sugimori or whatever. 1999 to 2000s. Okay, so he turns, he evolves into the ones we were looking at a minute ago. Dratini. We saw this one. The capture of first Dratini inspired the search for other legendary Pokemon. What? So he's like the OG. The capture of the first Dratini inspired the search for other legendaries. Hmm. He has no weakness. That's interesting. You're as cutie pie, little Eevee. Eevee. Tackle. She's so cute. A rare and unique Pokemon about which little is known, as few have been captured. Oh, it's so cute. That is by Nishida. And so he has two of these, and I think there may be, I'm guessing there might be more behind here because that feels a little thick. Porygon. Like, like origami. Uh, da, da, da. What does it say? More and more people play the slots every day trying to win a Porygon. What? <laughs> like a slot machine? Hmm. What is his weakness? I can't figure out what this weakness symbol is. I'm not sure. Psybeam. Alright, the last three for right now. Ratatata. We saw him before. He's cute. Trickery is his power. Loves to eat walnuts, chestnuts, cheese, and milk. Well, it's weird because I thought we saw him just a few pages ago, but I don't remember eating that. So he must be different? I don't know. <laughs> I'm getting confused. <laughs> Alright, Voltorb. By the way, he's by the same guy who did... Uh, he's by the same guy did Eevee, so, or girl, I don't know, but they know how to draw cute. Okay, Voltorb, Speedball. This looks like a Pokeball, doesn't it? Usually seen only in power plants, it's sometimes seen in towns apparently using power lines to travel. <laughs> well, this is interesting. And then we have Dark Electrode evolves from Voltorb. Rolling Tackle. Take all energy cards attached to Dark Electrode and attach them to your benched Pokemon. If you have no bench Pokemon, discard all. Do, and does anybody do that? Does anybody play that? Some researchers hypothesize that Electrode may actually be a form of energy instead of having an actual body. Whoa. All right, guys. Well, we still have a few more to look at. So maybe uh, next Sunday or something. Let me.
let me back back up. I'm going to just count up how many cards we have here so that I can put it on the um, description how many we look at. But thank you guys for watching. Um, I appreciate you being here and feel free to comment with anything you know or <laughs> I do read the comments but like I said I don't always remember everything you guys are being so lovely telling me oops, stuff about them and then I forgot to write it down like this <laughs> weakness but <laughs>